example, and tournament host Brazil last year. And now they have been essentially transforming into a major contender and showing a real edge of credibility and strength going into 2022 World Cup in Qatar this upcoming November. Significantly, Italy's midfield has been lacking a sense of positional awareness and much critical balance of uh, intricating short passing movements and uh, linking up open run uh, spaces uh, when uh, they needed to generate play out of back uh, uh, with their line of deep passing uh, force uh, necessary a struggle to generate uh, sustainable uh, passing rhythm in transitioning game into the midfield uh, much of it has resonated due to the absence of their main creative force and the team's little vision of uh, diving engine and ample creative star Marco Verratti who has a real potential and capability to create the momentum and uh, dictating the pace movement and uh, fluid uh, short passing exchanges that Italy really needed under pressure and perhaps to escape Argentina's intense while well, efficient pressing in all over the midfield. Although the introduction of the Leonardo Espinosolo has injected a spark of passing uh, mobility and uh, necessary off the ball transparency uh, for their midfield, particularly Marella and even Pessina to uh, aggregate between the lines and have some freedom to link up out of a deep line and having opportunity to move forward a little bit stretching out Argentina's midfield and on some occasions uh, of course you have seen Emerson has been offered with fine prospect of storming forwards and providing crafty overlap runs that uh, was necessarily linked up with Espinosola and the addition of uh, Manuel Locatelli who has been deployed into the more central line uh, passer and join uh, Italy's midfield in front of the trio to uh, generate some passive movement uh, to sustain uh, the build up Italy needed although under more limited condition and have some opportunity to give license for Italy's midfield initiating passes and freedom although for their attackers to uh, showing um, efficient uh, interplay uh, movement and on some occasion also uh, the Sassolo uh, midfielder uh, was given a chance to send a long range shot and from a cross that was provided by Emerson on the left hand side uh, Spinozola uh, neatly uh, linked up uh, with Persino to find the spaces going forward but uh, ultimately they lack a real cutting edge uh, productivity and a flash of uh, penetration to create chances behind Argentina's midfield and to go around their full backs as it necessarily just give them a sight of relief for 10 15 minutes but once again masterful and uh, intelligent uh, change of tactical element that was shifted argentina from their diamonds and initially dominant uh, midfield trio into reverting to the uh, midfield of, of foreman to cover more spaces and of course putting more pressure on italy's now rejuvenated uh, line of uh, central uh, playmaking that was i mean slightly inspired by uh, Spinazzola. The restoration of the position for Argentina once again uh, remain to be the same factor that necessarily put them back on a track as uh, they sustain uh, real uh, integration of the pressing strategy sharp uh, anticipating uh, the quick turn of the game and uh, having a balance uh, to win uh, the game off the ball in the pressing and uh, uh, sublime and neat uh, link up play in transition in the game into the midfield and perhaps for their wing backs to also and giving a freedom uh, to target uh, the spaces attacking the spaces behind Italy's midfield and courtesy to that movement Lionel Messi was further uh, being offered with free position to aggregate and create chances combined with their wing backs and uh, also provides neat interchanging position through his magical amazing incredible dribbling skills uh, neat link up play and darting run that as ever since Italy's midfield and backline seem to be losing the ball, they always had the pressure of being threatened by Messi. Even though after Angel de Maria and Le Solsi left the pitch, the presence of Paolo Dybala once again ignited the same caliber of fluid interchanging position and flash of dynamism and combination play that quickly has seen Argentina switching the point of passing moving into more crafty combination across the field and linking up with the central uh, positions, flanks and uh, 
while sustaining a sharp but more uh, pragmatic decline of the pressing and uh, off the ball movement that compared to the first half predominantly was integral to maintain Italy's uh, growing pressure Argentina really have done a fantastic job to once again dictate the pace of the game and control the much in the position and Italy uh, although sharply given a chance to necessarily improve in the second half and uh, provide a bit string of the passing movement and some transparent uh, uh, form of uh, combination playing going forward but ultimately they lacked uh, much needed and integral uh, vision of spontaneous change of uh, pace brilliant and the end product uh, tempo and necessarily productivity uh, to create movement uh, due to lack of having those ample creative players in attack that been absent and ultimately Argentina won this game when Dybala cruising uh, a great opportunity at the end of a fantastic combination and a transition movements with a product that seen Messi orchestrated neat run into the deep uh, line of Italy's backline broken uh, their defense and off the ball movements by uh, Palacios uh, just needed to be uh, linked up uh, with Dybala's quick uh, anticipation to uh, seal the ball uh, striding to his left hand side with uh, the first excellent touch uh, striking the shot into the near post and sealing Argentina uh, a crucial 3-0 victory uh, at the end of a very dominant and uh, brilliant performances and Italy now left lots of work to do of course uh, transitioning into a new era after a disastrous uh, elimination and uh, missing out on a second uh, consecutive World Commercial Tournament which uh, left the nations into uh, a mayhem also experienced a much and uh, critical uh, growing pressure and uh, entirely problematic change of the era with Roberto Mancini uh, looking into the future to rebuild and uh, find a serious reconstruction that that requires uh, personal, tactical strength and uh, also uh, rejuvenation and caliber of the new talented crew to be emerging in the heart of Italy if they want to stand a chance in the future. And for Argentina, they have seriously uh, inspired a real path to uh, create a platform as one of the World Cup's uh, legitimate and fierce uh, contenders going to the World Cup with the tactical balance, uh, technical enthusiasm and uh, brilliant uh, vision of uh, ample creativity that was inspired by Lionel Messi.